and how you approach them is everything. Gary Klugowitz, a Milwaukee consultant, is on campus this week teaching UVM police how to lower the temperature of everyday interactions. They call it persuasion communication. Our job is, is very simple. Is that, you know, how, how, you, how you talk to people. Good morning. I'm Deputy Klugowitz, Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office. The reason I'm approaching you today is I, I saw you wandering park. I look a little bit lost. Is there something I can do to help you? Is that better than, hey, bud, what are you doing here? Go ahead. That's so, that, I'll get that in a minute. <laughs> to demonstrate, they had me put on a Kevlar vest and a real gun belt. There you go. You can hook that. Which felt like a compression garment. Don't press any of the buttons unless I tell you to. Get into a police cruiser and pull over a motorist. She's actually Vistalar trainer Jill Wiesensel. I'm supposed to give her a ticket for speeding down Main Street through a red light. Morning. Morning. How you doing? I don't know. I'm, I'm going to be late for work. She's annoyed, says she'll be fired from her job for being late, and it's close to Thanksgiving. He's like, it's already 1044. She's pushy. So, so here's your ticket, ma'am. Later, rips up the ticket I give her. Still. Well, I thought, you know, you approached, you were polite. Um, I would have liked to know who you were and uh, which department you were with. Despite my rookie mistakes, the takeaway is the interaction. UVM Chief Leanne Toomey, a big believer in officers conveying respect. We're safer because the interaction is safer. Of her department's 10,000 incidents last year, only 50 involved physical contact, she says. Half of 1%. The foundation of everything that we do comes down to interpersonal skills. Obviously important to police work, Vistalar says they also provide training to utility workers, school teachers, bus drivers. The reality in today's America. Everybody's just wrapped up way too tight, and everybody has all this conflict, and you carry that all with you. All right, that'll roll. But treat people respectfully. And show them that respect. It's amazing what can happen. In Burlington, Stuart Ledbetter, NBC5 News. I was expecting. We'll see.